problem based on expanding a binomial so here we are going to perform a problem based upon the expand the expansion of a binomial in an advanced level so when we assume the binomial as x plus y and the exponent of the binomial as n then its expansion will be of n c 0 into x to the power of n minus 0 into y to the power of 0 as the first term and the second term will be of n c 1 into x to the power of n minus 1 into y to the power of 1 and this third term will be of n c 2 x to the power of n minus 2 into y to the power of 2 plus dash a dash and the last term that is the n plus 1 term will be of n c n into x to the power of n minus n into y to the power of n. Then now here we are performing an example under the expansion of a binomial. Say here expand the binomial that is x square minus 3 divided by y square whole to the power of 5. Then now the solution starts. So, as per problem the given binomial is of x square minus 3 divided by y square whole to the power of 5 is the given binomial. But here, but we know that according to binomial theorem, the expansion of the binomial is of x plus y whole to the power of n is equals to n c 0 into x to the power of n minus 0 into y to the power of 0 as the first term and n c 1 into x to the power of n minus 1 into y to the power of 1 as the second term plus n c 2 into x to the power of n minus 2 into y to the power of 2 plus the n plus 1 term will be of plus n c n into x to the power of n minus n into y to the power of n. Whereas, here the coefficients of the binomial are of n c 0, n c 1, n c 2 and dash dash up to n c n. Say here as per the problem the binomial coefficients are of n c 0, n c 1, n c 2, n c 3 and similarly and so on up to n c n. In order to find out n c r, so the formula is of n factorial divided by n minus r factorial into r factorial is the formula in order to find out the binomial coefficient. So, in this manner by using utilizing this n c r equals to n factorial by n minus r factorial into r factorial we have to find out n c 0, n c 1 and so on up to n c n. But as per problem So, here x square 
minus 3 divided by y square whole to the power of 5 whereas in this the n value as per the binomial theorem the n is of 5 and the number of terms in the expansion is equals to 1 more than that of the exponent of the binomial say here the exponent is of 5 so here we have to add 1 to this exponent that is equals to 6 so 6 is the number of terms of the in the expansion of the binomial that is x square minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 5 then now in its expansion first of all let us find out the coefficients that has binomial coefficients nc0 nc1 nc2 and so on but whereas as per the condition so here the coefficients are of when we expand x square minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 5 so it will be of x square minus 3 divided by y square whole to the power of 5 is equals to n c 0 so here n is of 5 5 c 0 into x to the power of x is of so we have to replace so here x by means of this x square and y by means of minus 3 by y square then now its expansion will be of n minus 0 so here n c 0 into x to the power of so x value is of x square whole to the power of n minus 0 so it is of 5 minus 0 into y so y is of minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 0 plus the next term will be of n c 1 that is 5 c 1 because n is of 5 into x to the power of that is x square to the power of n minus 1 that is of 5 minus 1 into y to the power of y is of minus 3 divided by y square but whole to the power of 1 then now plus next term will be of n c 2 so it is of 5 c 2 into x that is x square whole to the power of n minus 2 that is 5 minus 2 into y to the power of minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 2 next term will be of n c 3 that is 5 c 3 into x to the power of that is x square to the power of n minus 3 that is 5 minus 3 into y to the power of that is minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 3 plus n c 4 is of 5 c 4 into x to the power of that is x square to the power of n minus that is 5 minus 4 into y to the power of minus 3 by y square whole to the power of 4 plus the last term will be of so last term in the expansion of the binomial is of n c n because n is of 5 so here the expansion the coefficient will be of 5 c 5 then plus 5 c 5 x value is of x square whole to the power of 5 minus 5 that is n minus n into y to the power of that is minus 3 by y square whole to the power of n that is n value is of 5 again first of all let us find out the coefficients we know that but n c 0 value and n c n will be of each equals to 1 so here similarly based upon this here n value is of so here since n is equals to 5 then that implies so here n replaced by means of 5 here then 5 c 0 and 5 c 5 so here n by means of 5 and n again by means of 5 these values will be of each one so here therefore so here n c 0 that is 5 c 0 value is of 1 and similarly 5 c 5 is of also of 1 then the remaining coefficients those are of phi c 1 because phi c 0 value and phi c 5 values are of 1 we have to find out phi c 1 phi c 2 phi c 3 and phi c 4 by utilizing this formula then now so here phi c 1 so phi c 1 is equals to so here the formula is of n factorial by n minus r factorial n factorial divided by n minus r factorial into r factorial so here n value is of 
5 and r value is of 1 then so n factorial so n factorial is of 5 factorial divided by n minus 1 that is n minus r so here 5 minus 1 factorial into r factorial so here r is of 1 so that is of 1 factorial so that is equals to 5 factorial so here but n factorial is given by means of 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 dash dash into n so here based upon this formula so we can find out when n is replaced by means of 5 we will be getting 5 factorial then that is equals to 5 factorial as 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 overall divided by 5 minus 1 is of 4 4 factorial is of 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 1 factorial as 1 so here by cancellation 1 to 3 fourths and here 1 to 3 4 5 by 1 is of 5 so in this manner i got so here therefore nc 5c 1 so here 5c 1 is of 5 so here we got the 5c 1 coefficient as 5 so now we have to find out 5c 2 so here in order to find out 5c 2 so here n must be replaced by means of 5 then r is equals to 2 then now that is equals to n factorial that is 5 factorial overall divided by n minus r that is 5 minus 2 factorial into r factorial r is of 2 factorial then that is equals to 5 factorial can be written as based upon n factorial formula we can write it as 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 as per this condition 5 factorial divided by 5 minus 2 is of 3 3 factorial is of 1 into 2 into 3 into 2 factorial as 1 into 2 so here by cancellation 1 into 2 into 3 in the denominator 1 into 2 into 3 in the numerator so here further cancellations 2 1s in the denominator and 2 2s in the numerator that is equal to 2 into 5 is of 10 overall divided by 1 1s is of 1 that is equal to 10 by 1 is of 10 so here therefore 5c2 value 5c2 is equals to 10 then now 5c3 so whereas here so n is equals to 5 then now r is equals to so value is of 3 then now that equals to so here n factorial n factorial is of 5 factorial divided by n minus r that is 5 minus n 5 minus 3 factorial into r factorial as 3 factorial that is equals to 5 factorial as 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 overall divided by 5 minus 3 is of 2 2 factorial is of 1 into 2 into 3 factorial is of 1 into 2 into 3 by further cancellation 1 into 2 into 3 in the denominator 1 into 2 into 3 in the numerator will be gets cancelled then now say so are 2 1s in the denominator and 2 2s in the numerator will be gets cancelled 2 5s is of 10 overall divided by 1 1s is of 1 in the denominator is equal to 10 by 1 is equal to 10 so here yeah, therefore 5 c 3 is equal to 10 5 c 3 value is of 10 then now so we have to find out the next fact next coefficient binomial coefficient as 5 c 4 then now 